room for me, bub. Okay. I gotta have room for my butt. <laughs> oh my god. Wow. Okay. Lulu. Ready? What's up, you dirty plant bits and bobs and all you dirty little plant enthusiasts out there? It is I, Rachel, your plant madam. And this is Lilu, and this is Winston, and they are both very tired. Of your shit. <sighs> Peapot, we're filming a video. Are you still in frame? Cool. All right. Every whole gang's here. For today's video, I'm going to go around the house and show you some weird stuff, some oddities. Oh, I'm sorry. Would you like to get down? There you go. Her first grooming is this Thursday, and I'm so excited to see what she looks like. She's going to be so cute. But first, before we get into all that, today's video is sponsored by Skillshare. Skillshare is an online learning community with thousands of inspiring classes for creators. Explore new skills, deepen existing passions, and get lost in creativity. It's curated specifically for learning, meaning there are no ads and they're always launching new premium classes so you can stay focused and follow wherever your creativity takes you. Skillshare is so amazing that they hooked my viewers up with a one month free trial instead of the usual 14 days. So the first 1,000 of my subscribers to click the link in my description box will get one full month free trial of Skillshare, which is super valuable. So you can start exploring your creativity today. Here's some classes I have queued up for myself because boy golly do I need a lot of help with photography. Portrait photography, capture incredible shots with Jessica Kobiesi. Photography for Instagram, capture and share your life with Hannah Argyle. Holistic interior design, transform your personal space for well-being by Clear Studios. And the ultimate self-care playbook by Jonathan Van Ness. Whether you're a dabbler or a pro, a hobbyist or a master, you're creative. Discover what you can make with classes for every skill level. Thank you so much to Skillshare for sponsoring today's video. So really quickly, I just wanted to show you guys like just some cool stuff that's happening around the house. I'm sorry that the tank is so loud. It needs to be filled up, but, and I know this is gonna really make it to where I have to fix the drywall and I'm contemplating going ahead and ripping it down, but I just did this one. No, two. These two little spots right here with the Velcro tape, the green Velcro tape and some push pins. And it automatically started sticking on its own. Now, obviously, don't do this. Don't try this at home, kiddos. <laughs> but if you're trying to adhere your plant to a moss pole, perhaps, or a plank of wood or something like that, that's an excellent way to do it. And I just thought, it looks pretty cool. I'm okay to repair the drywall. I'm good for it. I'm good for it. So right now we are in my medium tent. That's what I have it labeled as on my uh, light timer. And this is my Anthurium Magnificum crossed with Crystallinum from NSE Tropicals. Um, this is the one that Harley has one and also Cody has one and here is the current berries these berries look completely different than the berries from the other anthurium bloom in the other tent oh one of them's ready oh they're starting to pop you guys so cool uh, I didn't even see that oh and look there's a mealybug hiding right there. I'm going to be honest with you guys. The pests are really giving me a run for my money again. That's why we've been trying new stuff and some new products. Oh, a lot of these are ready to go. Oh, good. I'm so glad I came in here to check on that. Awesome. So yeah, so that's definitely something cool that's happening in here. What else cool is happening in here? Okay. So this is the size of my newest variegated heart leaf um, that I've had on the pole in here. It actually has two vines. I need to get something so that you guys can see the size like a Coke can. I'm gonna start using a Coke can or something. 
so you guys can see the actual size but I mean this is just really really cool the variegation is really neat I mean it's really beautiful I mean and it's huge you guys remember me uh, repotting this on a members only video and please forgive me <laughs> I'm just so behind I suck I suck at my members only videos I'm gonna try to get one out I'm trying to wait on Casey to do one with me so we'll get one out as soon as we can but this is just really cool it's grown such a, a lot I repotted it in this like big pot down here and it's just done all that in the moss pool. I just thought it was really, really cool looking. So, that's something cool. Basically, all the new variegation on my Aurea, Aurea or my um, Marmorata cuts are absolutely amazing. The chunky half moon variegation on these guys, I feel like literally is a blessing. Like, wow, look at that. And this was the first like little baby wonky leaf that it put out and I was like holy crap and also the newest one here this just big chunk of green over here and all three quarters is yellow and also I don't know how I'm gonna be selling this I'm like au auction maybe or something like that I'm not a hundred percent sure but yeah that's something that's really really wicked cool that's happening for sure some not so cool things that are happening are, you know, um, I had a couple of things of rust pop up, so that sucked. Uh, you know, like I said, the spider mites are trying to really crop up everywhere. Cody's Alocasia cubria that he sent me putting out its first new leaf. Pretty damn excited about that. Then, um, of course, the things from Botanicas are doing wonderful. This leaf right here, um, this is my fault because I accidentally left my tent open like an asshole. So, this is my bad. But everything else is looking really great. So, from that, from that order. So, that's something also cool that's happening. Let's go into the um, small tent and I'm going to show you some cool stuff in there real quick. So here is the small tent and I'm kind of sort of calling this my begonia tent. Now, obviously not all begonias. Um, and you'll see some stuff in here like, you know, it's not having the best of times. The transition has been a little hard on a couple of things, but there are new leaves. You can tell it's beginning to straighten up. You guys can see this is the cool thing that I wanted to show you. You guys know how much I struggle with this heartless bitch of a plant right here look at all the way over to the damn wall look at this yeah i don't know what that's about either if you know what that's about tell me tell me something in the comment section oh it's like connected to the pot you gotta get back over here oh shit well like i gotta Let me put you down for a sec. <laughs> okay, so not the prettiest like setup in the world. I actually, that's a coat hanger. So yeah, but anyways, look at how good she's growing and look at the little bitty baby leaves. How beautiful is this plant? Oh my God, I love it so much. Uh, Peanuts Plants, who is about to have her baby, or maybe has had her baby at this point because I haven't been on Instagram much. I'm trying to, like, take a roof off. Those, those leaves look all moldy. Hang on. Hang on again. Hold tight. These are the things that you have to do. This is this is like tent maintenance, and I can't throw leaves on the ground because Mrs. Lily will try and come and grab them. Sometimes when I'm doing like maintenance, I just throw the leaves on the ground because uh, I have so many leaves that I have to cull that um, I just sweep up when I'm done. You know what I mean? Hey, what are you doing? No, ma'am. 
So anyways, I got rid of those sussy leaves, but yeah. Also, this Ludwigi eye, remember how I told you that, remember it was like playing video games and not respecting me? And you know what I mean? Look at how much it's grown. I know it's not super impressive, not super duper, but and it'll probably die next week because I'm showing it to you, but it's kind of the way it feels like it's going. But the cool thing in here that I wanted to show you is this right here. So you remember how I told you guys that I felt like my red chlorosticta was on the verge of dying? That like everybody said that they kind of just die back and um, melt a lot on people like after a full year or after a full like, uh, you know, cycling of seasons or whatever, but uh, he came back, my begonia red chlorosticta came back. Um, so I'm really, really excited about it. You can actually, there's like a, get out of my way, you burkutia. There is actually a stem right there going all the way up. You see, and there's some leaves right there. But this is the part that actually looks really good. So yeah, really excited about that. They came back from like the brink of death, which is really, really nice. My Begonia Rockii uh, died, did not make the transition to the tent. That sucked really, really, really bad because I really loved it and it only had one leaf at a time. So I was trying to, you know, make it work, but I failed. What are you doing? Where are you at? Lilu. Lilu, get out of there. Come here. Lilu, what do you got? Oh, you get out of there. You can tell when she's been somewhere that she's not supposed to be because she gets like dust bunnies all over her face. <laughs> hey, my little sweeper, sweeper. Oh, my little sweeper, sweeper. Oh, you cute girl. Oh, here comes Wayne Yeah, did you know that Lilu gave Winston kennel cough? Did you know that? Yeah, her came home and gave Winston the kennel coughs. Oh no. But anyways, the bottom of it looks like shit, so don't uh, pay no mind to the man behind the curtain. Okay, yoo-hoo, big summer blowout. <laughs> Is that all the cool stuff I have to show you? Oh, one more thing, one more thing. Okay, so the other cool thing that's happening, and I know y'all are sick, y'all are sick of me being in this big ass tent and you're sick of hearing about it, okay? And I get it, I hear you. I saw, I get it, I get it, but look at this. Oh, hang on, let me, let me move the... Whoa, isn't that cool? Look at how big. Look at how gorgeous. And then look at this. You're gonna shoot your pants. Whoa, look at that. This is my most favoriteest mother plant of all time. The variegation put out by this freaking elbow. It'll just, it'll knock your freaking socks off. Leave, leave a sock emoji or a foot emoji if your socks are knocked off because that, that's a beautiful, beautiful lure ass leaf right there. That is beautiful. And that all came off of this cut right here. This is the quote unquote favorite elbow that Casey took this top cutting of and put it in his deal and he brags about it all the time like he did something. Woo! So in love. Oh no. Oh no. No, no, no. <gasps> Bro. Bro. Damn. Uh, what else cool is happening? Check out this fucking sweet ass re regal bloom. Oh, it's so cool and powerful looking. It's so different than all the other ones. It almost looks like a, um, 
a spathophyllum bloom, doesn't it? How trippy. And I lost the last Ace of Spades bloom. It did not take. It did not take at all. But I've got another chance right here because this is the that is the actual latest leaf. I don't know why we got some yellowing. I think someone suggested in the last video that it might be nutrient burn. And I'm going to lean towards that because I did. I may or may not have gone a little bit too ham with the um, Miracle Grow the last time around. You know, someone said something about nutrient burn. And I was like, that does sound like something that I may have done. Uh, maybe because, look, this one's actually yellowing a little bit too. I mean, still still looking pretty good but it's it is yellowing and i think it is my fault i think i did burn a little bit with some nutrients trying to pump everybody up trying to make everybody swole and i think i may have you know went a little too ham hey, what do you think about it Winton? Hmm? Oh. see i've had a cough you guys and i have not felt the best and now i'm on antibiotics yeah yeah, and I'm getting special baby treatment. Yeah. Yeah. Which is not feeling good. Oh. Come on, let's get out of this hot tent. You want to get out of this hot, hot tent? Oh, take my boy. Oh, he's my baby. Oh, he's my baby. He weighed 32 pounds at the vet's office yesterday. You know how much Lily weighed? She weighed 3.6. <laughs> Those cough pills that he's on make him sleepy. Come on. Come on. Time to go. Time to go. Tell everybody bye. Time to go. We gotta go. Bye. Um, let me move those for you. Is that better? Okay, they're moved. Okay, come on, Lilu. Good boy. Thank you so much for watching today's video. I really hope that you enjoyed it. Be sure and give it a like down below if you did. I hope that you guys have a wonderful week. Thank you so much again to Skillshare for sponsoring today's video. Peace out. Later, taters. Bye. Hey, bye. Doki, 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 doki. <laughs> bye. And now I would like to give a big Dirty Plant Enthusiast members only shout out to Seven Puggies, Cindy C, Abby Gilbert, Ace Cadet, Alexandra Chilton, Alina Cameron, Always Propagating, Amanda Davila, Amy Adwan, Apollonia, Ashley Caraveo, Ashley Sexton, Bailey Barnett, Bethany Estes, Bougie Panda, Bren, Carly Grinnell, Casey Dillon, Casey Glidewell, Chamomile Camille, Chelsea Bertucci, Colleen Hatton, Corey Traxler, Crazy Plant Lady, Cuties with Cardi, Danielle Holt, Darren Heppel, David Sawyer, Deandra Bella Rose, Emily Kingsley, Aaron Roche, Finner Lamb, Fredo79, Goncalo Martins, Gretchen Ward, Haley Martin, Haley Kester, Hannah Gould, Harper Gray, Heather Summers, Heidi Christofferson, Hells Bells, Holy Coley, Houseplanty Goodness, Hunter Jolly, Jamie Ellis, Jake Rowe, J.S., Jenna Maria, Jennifer Girolametto, Jessica Viola, Jody Smith, Cassandra Hines, Kathy W., Katrin, Kelly Hodgson, Kim Toby, Kimberly Mossman, Not Dude, Christy Bim, Kaya Hauser, Kylan Cooper, Lauren Loves Lees, Leah Tarbuck, Lily W, Lilac Moore, Lillian Morin, Lisa Nolan, Lola Isabel, Luis H, Luna Moth Forest, Maggie Davis, Mrs. McGrath, McKenna Smith, Mackenzie Hogarth, Mara Baker, Maureen W, Megan Moyna, Meeks, Mev H, Michelle A, Michelle Meckle, Michelle Reed, Michelle Watts, Monica Allison, Monica Humphreys, Nikki Toller, Ordinary Plant Girl, Pam's Pretty Plants, Plants Every Inch 902, Rachel Sharp, Rhea Shields, Ricky Mulbeck, 
Safia Bahadir, Soholio, Sarah Santis, Sarah Parrish, Seth Miller, Showers ASMR, Sophie, Sophie Bodding, Steph Miller, Stephanie Bazella, Stephanie Menzies, Tanya Houtsaker, Tara Christensen, Taylor Kaysen, T, Tiffany Wright, Trent Grolmus, Birdigree Dreams, Bernie Zhu, Victoria Vonseca, and Wesley Lamentino. And now, I would like to say a big, dirty, and nasty shout out to all of my dirty, dirty, dirty ass plant hoes out there who get members only access to the prop shop and my once a month live chats. Danny Ryan, Alex Truell, Alexandra Kennedy, All Fallon's Franz, Allie Pierpoint, Allie Wells, Allison Havens, Alyssa Braden, Amber Metter, Amy Baxter, Andrew Wolf, Angela's Foliage Affair, Anna D, April Showers, Buy Me Flowers, Aerial Roots are Lisa B, Ashley Kathleen, Aubrey Puff, Botanicaz, LLC, C. Woe, Cassidy Walker, Kate Christie, Chelsea Clifton, Chrissy Spencer, Christina Kuntz, Christy Stewart, Sierra Jones, Danny Sprague, Deanne U. Santos, Denise Tomer, Diana Warner, Ellen Hoover, Emily Cephalu, Emily Forge, Emma LaCroix, Emma Wiley, Erica David, Florence Ramirez, Gab, Gabby Barnaby, Gina the Great, Haley Eblen, Haley Stanley, Hazel Foreman, Heather Lamb, Heather Lucart, Heather Worrell, Henrik Arnes, Hollis Good, Houseplant Heather, Izzy H, Jum Meow, Jasmine Renee, Jedi KCC, Jennifer Rouse, Jennifer Lee Johnson, Jenny Vanderbilt, Jess Marvel, Jessica McCock, I'm not sure, Jessica Stanford, Jill Cunningham, Joanna Meyer, Joanne Hernandez, Caitlin Guavi, Karen Brackville, Carissa, ah. Caitlin Oates, Catherine Sproles, Katie, Kayla Taylor, Kelly Smith, Kelly Costello, Kelsey Cowan, Kim Latimer, Kristen Williams, Christy D, Christy Leah B, Laura C, Mary Boots, Mark Straw, Megan Earls, Megan Gowdy, Melissa Hartog, Melissa Mins, Michelle G, Mirena, Miss Lisa, Natural State Ashley, Nicholas Caruso, Nikki Grilly, Odd Avocado Tree, Olivia Wise, Peyton Gold, Pinky from Hot Farms, Plant Friend Down the Street, Plant Princess Simonetta, QR, Rianne Chekasang, Rico 9383, Riley Elizabeth, Wren, Root and Leaf, Sarah Schwartz, Savannah Archuleta, Shannon Mattingly, Shay Bro, Spotted Oreo 10, Stacey Anderson, Stephanie McKinnis, Tammy Carroll, Tara Peterson, Tara's Plants, Tropics in the Midwest, Teddy Ruxpin, Tara Wolfgang, Tess Botsis, That Girl and Her Dog, The Fiber Circus, The Hatter's Madness, The Plants Channel, The Plants Meow, Tim Burton, Tracy Buzzle, Tyler Frakes, Valerie, Vanessa Gutierrez, Venus J, Victoria Olson, Wendy Hartman, Whitney Sales, Wicked Witch Roxy, Will H, Winter Rose, and Yvonne Smith. Thank you so much, guys, for your monthly support. I hope that you guys enjoy your membership perks. I hope that you guys have a wonderful, wonderful week. I will see you on next Wednesday at 7 p.m. Central. Love you. Bye.